Welcome to the setup tutorial of the Atlantis Hex FX guitar with a Roland GR55. Once you have turned on the Roland GR55, you need to see whether it's in guitar mode or bass mode. Here we want to switch it over from bass mode to guitar mode. To do that, you press the edit button on the far right and then the page button to the right all the way over until you reach the system menu. Go up to the scroll wheel and press the right arrow button and scroll over to where it says Backup. Press Enter, then with the right arrow again, scroll over to where it says Guitar and Bass. Press Enter. It's asking you to change over to Guitar. Then press the right arrow again to move it to OK and press Enter. Restart the GR55 and now you are in guitar mode. Now it's time to do the pickup optimization. Press edit, then press the page button on the right and scroll over to the system again. When you are on the GK setting, press enter. In the pickup menu, let's take the GK3 and put it to piezo. And in the scale setting, let's go from Strat to Les Paul. On our distance from the string, uh, from the pickup rather, to the bridge, we'll go from 20 down to 10 for each of the strings. Regarding the sensitivity, this will be one of your more critical areas. And again, it's just a starting place. For me, I'm going down to about 20 for each string setting. You may find that you have to actually readjust this and change it to something that's going to work based on your playing style and how it affects the GR55. For the velocity settings, I use 7, 1, and 7. The last setting that we're concerned about is nuance, and that is set at 5 and 5. Now go back to the pickup menu where you can actually enter a name for your Atlantis Hex Effects guitar. Press the Enter button and then put in the name that you want. In this way, these settings for this particular guitar will be stored. If you have other guitars that you can connect to a GR55, you can have different settings for them, independent of each other. Everybody attacks strings differently, and some play aggressively, some with lighter touch. Remember that these settings that I've suggested are just a starting place. If you find that they don't work for you, you'll need to go back and readjust through the pickup, the distance, sensitivity, velocity, and nuances.